This one is probably my favorite social media platform. And the reason why it is uh, because I spent a lot of time scrolling and consuming content in this platform. And if you are an advertiser, you probably are thinking on um, create campaigns here to address the right communication to the right audience every single minute. So this time we're going to understand what are the most relevant metrics to integrate in a social media report when talking about TikTok ads. With this report, you can understand and visualize the most relevant metrics to determine the success of your TikTok ads campaigns. You can also share this dashboards um, daily, weekly, or monthly to make better and faster decisions around your ads strategy. This TikTok ads overview report for Google Data Studio is comprehensive and it covers from the most meaningful information around what are the contents and its performance and obviously the performance in terms of cost and spend. This template contains a conversion funnel here where you can see the money or the budget that you have and how it, uh, how it has been spent and also the impressions obtained and obviously the conversions. Then you can also see the audience that you are targeting, the gender of your um, consumers of the content and obviously the impressions by age. Here you also have information about the content itself. So here you have the reach of the content and you also have video play actions and this metric that is too relevant for me and this is the average video play. This is probably my favorite part of this report because here we can see the information of every single piece of content. So here I have also the thumbnail of the content that I shared on this social media. Obviously the text because probably we are doing um, some A-B testing so this is really important to have not only the thumbnail but the text. Also the impressions obtained by every or by a specific piece of content also have uh, clicks, cost and impressions and obviously you can display cost, clicks, impressions, campaign objectives. Um, this one for example is the CPM and you can switch between the metric that is more relevant for your business or for your content um, strategy. Now I'm going to show you uh, how I got here to this report and how you can integrate your data in a really comprehensive visualizations like this. I just typed portermetrics.com on my explorer and went here to the, through the resources tab and here on templates. Then uh, I looked for this specific section that is um, focused on TikTok ads and download this report. Then you only have to follow the steps here. You can start by downloading this template and if you need extra help, you can also contact our support team. There is also another way to go here and create your first report with TikTok ads. So here, if you are on Google Data Studio and you look for um, this data source, you can start typing here TikTok and you will see this little blue cat and you can just click here and start connecting with your accounts. If you go to the gallery, you can also see different visualizations of this metric around TikTok ads. So here, if you go and explore, you will see there are different uh, visualizations you can use to get inspired and obviously if you want to save time when creating your first report. There is one thing more. With Google Data Studio, you can integrate different data sources. For example, I have here different social media. I integrated here um, some information about my, my TikTok ads. And this is the perfect transition to explore our next connector, Twitter. <laughs> 